Was it quick? She died in battle. There was no prolonged suffering. Condolences for your loss. Heir's death has shaken me. I wonder if the dragons will kill or consume us all, one by one. We are at war, it's true. But we can win as long as we don't give up. Rest in peace, Heir. May the mountains hear her name until the end of time. Can't talk. My art deserves my full attention. Embrace the bear. Greetings. They say you were there when Air met her end. What killed her? It was a powerful dragon minion, one of Mordremoth's most dangerous. An abomination. I heard it was the head of the Nightmare Court herself. Is that true? She didn't deal the killing blow. That was a vicious jungle predator called a Vine Tooth. I've heard about the golden beans in the jungle. What are they? Glint foresaw that she would need protection for her last offspring. That's their purpose. But where did they come from? They were human volunteers, changed by the Forgotten into magical guardians and builders. They migrated to the jungle and built their fortress there. It's called Tarir. You know, I've always said she was destined to be the next leader of Holbrook. I can't believe she's gone forever. She was a powerful ally, and a loyal friend. Maybe you can explain it. I still don't understand why they didn't bring Yer's body back for a proper send-off. We couldn't risk her turning. Her son, Bram, took care of her himself. He honored her remains, I assure you. I thought only Silvari were vulnerable to Mordremoth's corruption. No, everyone was vulnerable. Anyone, Silvari or not, could be attached to one of their blighting trees. The trees created duplicates of people to serve Mordremoth. It was awful. Honor Wolf and be true. Remember, Ares What have you heard about the Silvari? Some folks in Holbrook are demanding we ban them. I've seen no evidence they're continuing to turn. To my friend, Air. Huh? Oh my. Oh. To my friend, Air. To, to Air. Air. Air's monument will be in good company. Yes. You made it. Of course, Newt. She was a dear friend. Let's head up. My people will be glad you're here. The stone. Some may have questions about what happened. I hope it's not why. I'm still struggling with that one myself. Aren't we all? Perhaps that's the answer Bram left to seek. He's not here? No. He arranged this and then took to the mountains. Mystery. The fire inside that boy. I almost feel sorry for any of Jormag's minions he comes across. Sounds like he's working through it in true Bram fashion. Good. Make yourself at home. Your Tribune friend certainly has. Now I'll leave you to it, Commander. Speak with whomever you wish, and celebrate. Or pay your respects privately. It's also the spirit of air can be found in either. Rest in peace, Air. May the mountains hear her name until the end of time. She had him dead to rights. We all knew it. And what was he going to do? Beg? Plead? Wasn't his style. And Air wouldn't buy it anyway. So, he just jumped off the ledge. Well, she wouldn't give him the satisfaction of escape, even to his death. She shot him before he hit the ground. <laughs> Damn, that Nord knew how to exact revenge. That's so just true. like her. <laughs> Thank you for that story, Tribune Brimstone. I'm not sure why no one's ever made a tapestry of that moment. Oh, hey, good to see you, Commander. You too. Spreading a little air cheer? Things were getting too serious. Just ensuring they remember the right air. Hey, 
You're that Redlock Trombone, the Revenant, right? Close enough. Now why don't you do Uncle Trombone a favor and buzz off? But I want to hear about the Blood Legion! Don't you think quietly weeping in the corner by yourself would be more fun than this? Nah, this is fine. Yeah. Have you heard from Zoja or Logan? I was crossing my fingers they'd be well enough to make this. Still both laid up on my last visit. Hmm, too bad. Mordremoth's death came with a great toll, for sure. You know, with those two out of the field, and Snaff and Air gone, and Kaith, well, there really is no Destiny's Edge anymore. We should admit I'm sorry, Ritlock. I know how important it was to you. But there's no sense in looking back. Maybe it's time to start again. Another guild? Would Air want us to do that? She wouldn't want us to get caught up in her death like she did with Snaffs. Regret gets you nowhere. And... Tyria would probably sleep more soundly with the Dragon Slayer at the helm of a new guild. We could do a lot of good. It didn't go perfectly, but the small group we had was pretty capable against Mordremoth. What would we call it? Fate's Razor! I will not be part of a guild called Fate's Razor. What about Dragon's Watch? Dragon's Watch. I like that. Can I be in it? No. But I've got my Uncle Beamish's magical sword! Not yet, kid. Commander, come see this! What's going on? <laughs>